You are on Midnight Texas. I am on Midnight Texas. Yes. And how has it been going so far? It's been fabulous. We have great fans, so we're super, super excited. You know, we're crossing our fingers that we get picked up for another season. And it's based off of Charlene Harris's book series, Midnight Texas. And for those of you that don't know, Charlene Harris wrote the books that created True Blood. So if you were a True Blood fan, then you're probably going to be a Midnight Texas fan. And, you know, we have angels and witches and demons oh my like what does that make you what are you fun. what well, is, i can't really say what i am yet because i play madonna who's also in the book um but her backstory is not quite revealed yet so i um i own the diner but we don't know how i got that diner so it'll come out in the wash to what I really am. <laughs> it's a woman of mystery. I yes, love it. A woman of mystery. There's a lot of women of mystery on there. Parisa Fitzhinley, Ariel Kebel. Uh, we have Peter Mentz on there, Francois Armand. It's just a beautiful cast and Sarah Ramos. We're really, really lucky. Yeah. So we're here tonight for Kids in the Spotlight. Yes. So how did you hear or get involved with this organization? Well, um, Mo McCray, um, great actor from Sons of Anarchy and Pitch, amongst ever, everything else, um, directed a uh, short for Kids in the Spotlight and asked me to be in it. So that's how I was first introduced to it. And then that following year, I had a big birthday party, and I decided in lieu of gifts to do a fundraiser, and I did it for Kids in the Spotlight. So at the time, Taiji didn't know, you know, and I just wound up calling her one day and said, hey, I'm throwing a big birthday party, and, you know, what will make me feel good is if all the guests, instead of giving me gifts, donate to the charity that I love, and I love you guys, and I want to do this. And little did we know at that time how much that helped her that particular summer with the program so ever since then I've just been an ambassador for kids in the spotlight and been able to come to all the events and help fundraise and do my part what was the best advice you would you've given some of the kids you've you know helped during the shorts and things like what was the best advice you could give to them or just anybody who wants to be in this entertainment industry no matter if they're 10 15 20 35 yeah well the great thing is is that kids are way more brilliant than we are they're so much smarter. They're, they have fabulous intuition and their imaginations run wild. You know, they're not jaded by the ways of the world yet. So they just go for it. So my best advice to them is always trust your gut. You know, do what you feel is right in the moment. And I will admit, I'm a student of these kids. You know, as much as we're there to help and to serve and bring the knowledge that we have from the industry to every project, the reality is you get so much more back from helping and from serving. And if you just pay attention, I mean, kids are the future. So they're way smarter than I will ever be. <laughs> way smarter. Well, that's the message for the day. Kids are way smarter than that's most right. adults. <laughs> exactly. I won't exactly. say you, I'll say most adults. Most adults, yes. Yeah. Yes. Thank you so much. Absolutely. It's so great meeting Thank you. Thank you, you too.